The Fox of the Pheasants, Short Moral Story for Children Today we have a book named The Fox, the Pheasants, Short Moral Story for Children. I think they're so pretty. I hope you guys really enjoy it. I love it. Please give this video a like if you enjoy it, and don't forget to subscribe for more stories. Thank you, reading. So, here we go. One moonlight evening, as Master Fox was taking his usual stroll in the woods, he saw a number of pheasants perched quite out of his reach on a limb of a tall old tree. The sly fox soon found a bright patch of moonlight where the pheasants could see him clearly. There he raised himself up on his hind legs and began a wild dance. First he whirled around and round like a top, then he hopped up and down, cutting all sorts of strange capers. The pheasants stared giddily. They hardly dared blink for fear of losing him out of their sight a single instant. Now the fox made as if to climb a tree. Now he fell over and lay still, playing dead, and the next instant he was hopping on all fours, his back in the air, and his bushy tail shaking so that it seemed to throw out silver sparks in the moonlight. By this time, the poor bird's heads were in a whirl. And when the fox began his performance all over again, so dazed did they become that they lost their hold on the limb and fell down one by one to the fox. Too much attention to danger may cause us to fall victims to it. The End Good job, friends. Thank you so much for reading with me. Bye, I'll see you next time.